Hello everyone and for today I will show you how to patch Windows 10 for RS4 version only. Uh, this is for RS4 1.8.0.3 and this patch is for build 1.7.1.3.4 and there is another build that supports by this patch. Uh, right now I want to show you here in personalize themes that I already have a custom theme but if I apply this custom theme uh, you can see that I don't have actual image of the theme it's not working the explorer background is white and everything is same and let's start to patch Windows 10 RS4 and I want to show you here uh, info about my PC that the version is 1.8.0.3 and the build is 1.7.1.3.4.4.8 okay uh, to patch Windows 10 you need to download take ownership and Windows 10 RS 14 patch uh, I will exit the files from the WinRAR and first what you need to do you need to go to take ownership here click on add take ownership right click click merge click run click yes click ok ok and then here inside of this folder we have a 3dll files that we need to replace so go to this PC local disk C Windows here find the folder system32 okay and I will start with theme DLL I will find this one here in system32 and I will rename it and I will replace it so let's start okay here is the first DLL file that I will replace but first you need to take ownership every system file that you wanna replace rename delete you need to take ownership and now I'm able to rename this to backup you can rename whatever you want but I want to keep that this is a backup and this is original file and then I will copy this one and I will paste it continue and I, I have replaced the first file let's go to second one Okay, here is the here is the second one. It's a little bit different, but anyway, right click, take ownership, rename, backup, copy this one, right click paste continue okay and the last one uxteam.dll uh, here's the uxteam here and like you see I have already one but this is uh, the file that I have already replaced I just have tested this and it's working and that is a reason why I'm making uh, this tutorial how to patch only for RS4. So let's take ownership of uxteam.dll, rename, backup, and I will copy this one, paste, continue, and that's it okay 
now I will go to the teams and I will again apply the custom theme and now I have the custom theme on my RS4 here's the custom theme like you see and now uh, I want to show you how to get rid of the white bar here I have already made a mini tutorials how to do this how to do this but anyway I want to show you right now and also if you see right click context menu is just a black background and I will show you how to fix this I will start with context menu here uh, here is the disable immersive context menu you can download it from the description below right click here merge click run click yes click ok uh, and for this you need to log off or restart your computer but anyway the last step is old new explorer and you have it for 32 or 64 bit and here is the application right click run as administrator and click install and like you see the white bar is gone and I have a completely custom theme on my Windows 10 RS4 and also for the start menu and taskbar like you see I don't have it but here in the properties I'm using start is back plus plus and if I select a custom theme and here in start is back configuration the start menu and taskbar will be appear I will click apply and that's it okay uh, I will back one more time just to show you that my context menu is fixed so now I will log off my windows okay I am back and like you see my right click context menu have uh, just the same design from the custom team and that is the point okay if you wondering how to replace the original windows file but I think that there is no need to do that in just in personalized menu you can select a default Windows 10 theme and you have done all the job and that's it you don't need to worry about anything but if you are wondering go to the Windows again go to the system 32 and here like you see there is a backup and there is a team DLL uh, right click take ownership and the windows will say windows protect your PC you just go to more info and run anyway to take ownership and then you can delete the the file and then you can rename this file to the original name and that's it so that's it that's how you can patch windows RS4 1803 thank you for watching and see you next time bye